And a large industrial fire in Clinton Township that caused massive explosions last night continues to smoke this hour. WWJ's Charlie Langton live in the area. Charlie, uh, where are you and what are you seeing? Well, I'm on 15 Mile and Kelly, probably a mile or so from the select distributors. That's what exploded last night around 9 o'clock or so. The explosions could be heard all the way to Mount Clemens and really beyond. And then if you add the flames in the air, lighting up the sky for literally miles. Uh, this uh, company makes uh, nitrogen tanks. They also do vapes and CBD products and lighters. So it's highly, highly flammable. Now, at the moment here, I am just sitting in a, like I said, on, uh, at, a, at a gas station speedway, Kelly and 15, again, about a mile or so away. But the smoke is in the air. It is it is really overpowering. Elizabeth Ferez, uh, she works here. She's the uh, one of the uh, workers here, and she actually heard the, the, the explosions last night, but then describe now. Yeah, you can still see the heavy smoke. You can smell the smoke in the air. Lots of crews, lots of flashing lights. Um, obviously, orange barrels per Michigan, right? Um, so hopefully they get it taken care of, everybody's safe, and, you know, that's all I can hope for. Gross Pike is closed from 15 to 16 miles, but, but Kelly is closed from... Uh, from a uh, 15 miles close rather from Kelly all the way to Grosbeck because the crews are there trying to just clean up the debris that's in the street. Uh, I just picked up a big chunk of uh, something you can kind of hear it in the background. Uh, it's all over here. Uh, avoid this area if you can. Reporting live here at Clinton Township, Charlie Langton, WWJ News Radio 950.